I love the law because it's an opportunity for me not only to run my own business, but for me to be a part of other people's business. We are able to see that business grow and take off, and it's satisfying to know that uh, we can provide counseling to them and help, and hopefully our experience can uh, provide the necessary ingredients they need to have a successful business. The ability to partner with a client. I've had great fortune to be able to work with some dynamic executives with great companies, but who needed help. I really get a kick out of helping a client who is in a crisis uh, mode. I like to get that call. I like to be able to uh, alleviate that initial stress. And then I like to be able to help resolve the crisis. I like working with the smaller businesses and the veteran-owned businesses because what's exciting to me is that entrepreneurial energy and the sense that they're going to take off somewhere. And I really like to be there to help them. What I love about practicing law is solving problems. So you meet a client, you hear what they have to say, you have to spend the time to get smart on what their subject is, what their problems are. And then the light bulb goes on and you've got it. And I love that part. I love the fact that practicing law, uh, there's a variety of issues on any given matter that arises, whether it be in the courtroom, uh, across the table, uh, in front of various agencies. Uh, so there's never a, a similar situation. The best piece of advice that I've received is that your integrity is everything, and it needs to show in everything that you do, because once you lose that, you can never get it back. You just have to work hard, and your reputation is the only thing that you have. So as long as you are nice and ethical and you have a good reputation, you will be just fine. If I had a success, my mentor had this great way of saying, well, that's one in a row for you. And it's a great reminder because if you got a good result in the next case, that's meaningless to the next client that walks in with their legal problem. Clients always come in and tell you what they want, but that's not necessarily what they need. And what I've learned is you need to communicate with the client to really go behind what they're asking for to find out what they need so you can properly advise them. I'd say that the advice that I use every single day is always be yourself. People can tell in negotiations if you're not being authentic. And if you're authentic, it really helps you get both sides on the same page and get a great deal done. When I first came to D.C., a colleague of mine told me to treat absolutely everybody with utmost respect. It seems like a simple principle, but he noted that, especially in Washington, D.C., you never know who you're going to be working for, with, against, at any given moment, and it just behooves all of us to treat everybody the way we like to be treated. <laughs>